Welcome everyone to the Tactical Tavern. My name is Tomas Salas and in this video we are reviewing the Bastinelli Lucy Raptor. This tactical fighting knife first appeared in the movie Lucy featuring Scarlett Johansson. Does it have what it takes to perform in the real world as much as it did on screen? We're going to answer that question and see if it earns itself the Tactical Tavern seal of approval. By the end of this review, you will have the necessary information to decide if it is worth adding to your everyday carry gear or tactical loadout. With that said, let's cut into it. Before we begin, if you love gadgets gear and upgrading your everyday carry with unique accessories, take a moment to drop a like and subscribe for more content like this. At the time of this review, you can find the Bastinelli Lucy Raptor for around $300. For that price, you get an Italian-made fighting knife with a 10.5 inch overall length. It has a 5.64 inch blade comprised of Bowler M390. This is an extremely durable and corrosion resistant steel that offers great edge retention. It comes in satin finish and also my favorite, which is that dark stone wash. The handle is constructed of textured G10 and also has a striking pummel on the end. With the Kydex sheath, this total package weighs in at just 6.2 ounces. I personally love the slicing capabilities that this Raptor has because of that super thin cross section. Paired with great edge geometry, it'll melt through a variety of different materials. Further getting me excited about this knife is that grip. It is unique, however, it is super comfortable in a forward grip and also extremely comfortable in a tip down edge forward grip. When you pick this knife up, you will notice how fast and lightweight it performs in the hand. Due to that added weight to the handle, it makes a very lively feeling knife, great for slicing, dicing, and piercing. There's also jimping where the thumb would be. And what I like about this is sure, you could use it to control the tip for push cuts, but you could also reverse it and use it to catch clothing and other attachments and limbs in order to transfer it for different methods of striking. The only downside I found with this knife is that the sheath out of the box does not come with any real attachments. Now this does give you some creative freedom on how you want to carry it, such as an inside the waistband loop, or if you're new to everyday carry, I highly recommend you check out discrete carry concepts clips. I do wish there were a few more eye attachments in order to include those clips just for a variety of different carry methods. I'm excited too because Bastinelli just announced a new convex grind Raptor, which has even more slicing geometry. So the answer is yes, this will perform off screen as much as you see it perform on screen in the movie. This certainly gets the Tactical Tavern seal of approval because of the geometry, the great slicing performance, and the variety of things you can use it for, from tactical, fighting, to even hiking. I would say this could be a possible outdoors knife. If you had nothing else on you, it could certainly do the trick. If you're a fan of Bastinelli knives, let me know your favorite model in the comment section down below, as well as what other gear you'd love to see reviewed. If you enjoyed the video or you found value from it, please make sure to drop a like, share, and subscribe because it helps support the channel. While you're there, turn on post notifications so you are the first to know of new videos coming every Tuesday and Thursday. Also, take a moment to follow us on Instagram at Tactical Tavern to get a behind the scenes look at new gear in the testing process and some fun videos you won't find here. With that being said, my name is Tomas Salas. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. And remember, be prepared, be practical, stay tactical.